One of the industry's icons, the Beatles decided to split up and passed away in 1970. This decision saddened the band's fans, and other problems most notably the relationship between Paul McCartney and John Lennon. The two main creative leaders also contributed to the band's dissolution. The rivalry that existed between McCartney and Lennon did not come from a deep place, rather it developed over time. Among the heartbreaking moments was their manager Brian Epstein's death in 1967. After Epstein resigned as frontman, the band members began to fight over creativity and management. Lennon was growing more and more involved in artistic and musical efforts, thus he wanted the Beatles to depart from their previous image. McCartney, though, would prefer to maintain the pop music staple that has contributed to the band's success. Their differences in perspective were even more pronounced when they wrote Abbey Road and Let It Be, the songs from their most recent album. With the release of McCartney's solo album, McCartney, which seemed to be the final straw for the Beatles' continuing existence, tensions reached a height in 1970. Lennon was outraged by McCartney's move because he saw it as a violation of the group's creative process. Fans of the Beatles were incensed when McCartney formally announced his departure from the band in April 1970. Lennon responded by releasing How Do You Sleep, which was taken to be a direct jab at McCartney. The biting lyrics addressed several aspects of McCartney's character and expressed deep dissatisfaction. Since then, the two have engaged in a heated public verbal conflict that has cultivated an atmosphere that is not conducive to the Beatles' survival. History still remembers the amazing music McCartney and Lennon created together, even after their tragic breakup. And the bitterness between them resulted in one of the saddest albums ever released in the music business. <laughs>